Hello everyone, in this tutorial, I will be showing you how to make custom resources in Godot 4 to get started create a new script. I will be making enemy resources, however, this could be for anything you would like. Inside that script, change extends node to extends resource. Now create a new class name, which we will call enemy since this is our enemy resource. Now we can delete these two functions, and here we will define our stats that we want our enemies to have. So for instance, we will have an export variable name, which we will set to a string. We'll also have a health variable. So variable health, we'll set that to a integer. And obviously what variables you have in here are completely up to you and dependent on your game. And now to use this resource, let's right click new resource, type in our enemy resource. And let's go to create a zombie. In our zombie, we can set his stats. So let's do zombie. Health will be 100. Strength will be 10. And now create a new 2D scene. We'll call this zombie as well. Create a new script. And in here, we will reference our zombie resource by typing at export variable. Then we'll just call it enemy resource. And we will set that to a enemy resource. And I'll save that. Now drag over your zombie to that resource. And now we have full access to our stats. So we could type print enemy resource dot health that we set before. Press play. You'll see we have 100 health. Let's take this a step further by adding a function to our enemy resource. So head over to it, create a new function. Let's do damage. So take damage. We'll pass in a damage value. We will subtract that damage value from our health and we will return health. Now back in our zombie script, we will type print enemy resource dot damage, and we'll take, let's say 10 damage. If we press play, you'll see we go down to 90 health. Now let's say you want to add multiple enemies to your scene. So we can simply do this by dragging and dropping zombie and another zombie. However, you'll notice the problem when we attack one, the other will take damage as well. To fix this, simply click on your zombie.tres and click local to scene. Now if you press play, the health will be taken separately. And the great thing about custom resources is we can now create as many enemies as we would like. So if we create a new resource, we can create another enemy resource. Let's call it goblin. We can now have a brand new enemy with all of our custom stats. And it can be completely unique. And you can see our new custom enemy. Anyways, guys, I hope you found this story helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.